This morning we're here because we're going to open the compromise gates at the Utah Lake outlet in an effort to more control the water that's released out of Utah Lake. Utah Lake is full and so we need to start releasing that water due to court order uh, to prevent flooding in Utah County. It's been since 2011 uh, since the, the lake has reached the full level. We had an exceptional snowpack year last year um, which filled the lake substantially and then due to some conservation efforts by the uh, public in Salt Lake County and Utah County, everybody doing their part to conserve that water, uh, it's definitely helped store water in Utah Lake. From here it'll travel down the Jordan River and uh, there are no deliveries required at this time of the year below here, so uh, most of this water should make it to the Great Salt Lake. For long-term sustainability of our water supplies, um, it is very beneficial for everybody to do their part and continue to conserve water for their outdoor use. Just because we have snowpack and things going on now doesn't mean that in the future we're going to have that. We've had, we we're just coming out of a, a long-term drought that, w that really had some impacts to our water use and, and we want to be ready for that in the future. In our water supply, it can change from month to month. If it turns off and turns dry and, and we don't get any more snowpack, then you know, things definitely uh, don't look as good as they do now.